Hey guys, welcome to my video. Uh, tonight's video is actually about this little device right here. This is my little battery swapper. So I have two relays with a simple circuit. Um, right now it's set up at about 14 seconds, but it could be turned right here to hours or days. Um, it's just two 230 amp relays, simple circuit. Uh, we got the two batteries bolt meters um, these amp meters can go either direction which is super neat so if they go to the right it's load if they go to the left it's charging which is really cool so you can see everything that's going on um, I have a, a little attraction motor I made from a vacuum cleaner motor and then my little capacitor pulser so we'll start from the batteries here so this comes in the batteries um, each battery goes to each relay and then the other battery they're both kind of alternated one here one here but they're flipped so when it goes from one side it's one direction and when it flips back the other way um, it's the opposite direction of the batteries you'll be able to see that so then the two batteries come in right there and the black and reds and then it splits off to the output part of it which is uh, purple and green so this comes out of a battery this goes into a battery and vice versa no matter which way they're going they could go either way which is very very cool and um, so you'd hear it clicking off it's set up at about 14 seconds right now just for demonstration purposes so let's fire up this motor and you'll be able to see how she works so right now the one on the right is the load see it's running about two two and a half amps and then the one at the left is charging and then it switched so now the one on the left is powering the motor and the one on the right is charging from the motor and then it switches again and just continues like that as long as you want to um, the relay system is actually powered off of one battery which is this battery so this battery is always uh, powering the system but it's not very much like 50 50 milliamps or something like that so if you're running a really small motor um, might not be perfect but for bigger motors and uh, bigger devices um, I think it's just right um, later on I might try some different ones but uh, for this little test it's working really nice see things pulsing along pretty neat so if you guys are interested I could do another video with the schematic and things like that so leave your comments I hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching